Hello, today I'm going to show you how to use PVC pipes, how to input them, how to extrude them, how to combine them, whatever you need. We're going to be in the design workspace, we're going to go to insert, McMaster car component. If you've used McMaster car before, it may have been for screws, bolts, nuts, any, any of the things they may have had, Tell tape if you need it. But we're going to type in PVC, we're going to find the PVC pipes, PVC fittings, and we're gonna select this, this first one, the fittings, which are basically connectors if you don't know what they are. We're gonna select 90 degree elbow, and for the tutorial we're gonna use a diameter of three inches. We're gonna go down, and we're gonna select the white and three inches. We're gonna, we're gonna go here. We're gonna be in this menu, and always select either SAT or STEP. I like to use STEP and you're going to download. No need to add to order, that's if you want to buy it and ship it in real life. So download, and here we have it in the construction design tab, and we're going to click OK, because we no need to adjust it. If you're doing a project on your own, you might want to rotate it, move it a bit, however you need. However you need. But now we're going to insert a new one, sorry, go to insert the drop down menu, not the picture. Make master car uh, component. PVC, standard wall plastic pipe for water, and we're going to go down here, 3 inches, and I'll select the white, just because why not, and we're going to select 5 feet, we're going to download, make sure it's 3D step or 3D sat, download, and here we have it, so clearly if I clicked OK right now it would be inside and that would just be uncomfortable, you can do that and hide the bodies as you use the joint tool, but what I like to do, move it up a bit just so there's a bit of gap in between. So now we have these, they're not connected, it's not what we want yet, it's very simple to connect them. You go here to the joint tool, which is essentially a fitting or combining tool, not exactly combined, just move together. We're going to select this inside ring, which captures this point, which is it's what we want to combine with the fitting and we're going to click this ring right here and they go together perfectly now there's no gap in between and just to check it we can use a section analysis which is basically a splitting tool, a cutting tool to make sure bodies are together and there's no gaps or imperfections inside the bodies we're going to go here, click OK and we're going to go to the right or left, you can do it wherever and you'll see that there is no gap. Fusion, the joint tool did it perfectly. Nothing wrong with that. And that's about it. If we want to color, I'm gonna hide the analysis. If we want to color it, maybe make it PVC white, as I like to call it. Go to appearance, go down here until you find the plastic tab. This is an ABS. There's no PVC option in here, so I just like to use acetyl resin because it looks very similar. And here we have a sort of PVC white, if you want to change the color, because most of, the, most of the presets, either for plastic or anything, are set to 1. If you want to change the color, you go back up here and select acetyl resin, acetyl resin. use a slider to find orange, and change it to whatever color you, need, color you need and that's about it no reason to do this but i can do an in canvas render if i want but i hope that helped you if you enjoyed this maybe leave a like or subscribe help me out too and hope you like this video see you